I am back here with a regular actual video and we are here with the Smash Bros collection. What up is me for two and I am here showing off the newest additions to my Smash Bros collection. Uh, Smash Bros collection, I try to get at least like three, maybe four um, groups of plushies together for the collection show off. Also, so hi to Master Hand once again but i am here showing off the collections that i've gotten recently two of which you've actually seen if you watch my smash bros collection updated video however some of you might not have some of you might not be new and i thought i would show you guys the new collection areas and then one of them you guys have not seen yet unless you go on tiktok actually tiktok uh at patu plays pokemon in the description below if you guys want to check that out i am trying to do some more videos on there so if you are interested get in there but I think we need to show you exactly which ones we have. So give me one second. All right, I want you guys to guess which plushies here are new to the collection. And I'm gonna start grabbing. And first off, we're gonna grab Rosalina. And next up, Fox. And finally, one that you haven't seen yet, Meta Knight. All right, give me one second and I'll get back over there and show you guys exactly what these plushies are looking like. Okay, and we are back here, guys. So I have three, like I said, y'all just saw them. And we're going to start off with my least favorite and we'll move up. Um, this Rosalina, I actually got at... I think Bakari. God, I got it from Bakari, yes. Um, they were trying to sell a Daisy plush. Let's see, is there actually a tag on here? Super Mario 3D World. So it's from the 3D World collection. I have no idea what year it's from. However, I did get this from Bakari, like I said, for literally like $4, which is not too bad for a Rosalina plush. Even though I'm not really a big fan of Rosalina, I played her a good amount in Smash Bros. for the 3DS. But I just, it was harder to really gain... I guess, I don't even know how to say it. I just wasn't really invested in her. Investment, we'll just say investment. But uh, Rosalina was a very cool plushie that I got for pretty cheap. Um, they were trying to sell Daisy too, however, the Daisy was really nasty looking, so I did not actually pick that up. However, it's pretty cool looking. I mean, the head right here, ooh, that looks kind of weird in the back. I'll be real, I'll be real. She has an eye, which I'm really surprised about right here. Um, and then Rosalina, I believe she came out actually on the Wii U slash 3DS version of Smash Bros. Um, her and Luma, and it was a pretty good combo, I think. I actually played her a pretty good amount. Uh, before I picked up Dark Pit, I actually played her a good amount, more than I thought I would. I have no idea why. I think it's just because I like Luma, because I really like Stars and Kirby. Uh, if you don't know, my other nickname besides P2 is Star, um, short for Starboy. <laughs> but that has nothing to do with this uh, pretty cool plushie and I'm glad to have it in the collection and then next up we have ourselves Star Fox and this Star Fox is the world of Star Fox Flex McCloud I believe Jack yep Jack specific right here it has its tag which is really cool from the year 2016 which you would think this would be an older plush because I never would assume Star Fox would get any plushies recently. I believe they had a game out around that time. Star Fox is a part of the OG cast from Smash 64. And part of the thing right here came off um, before I even bought it. So I'm either going to have to fabric glue it or I'll sew it. Honestly, my girlfriend will probably be sewing it. Let's be real. <laughs> I am not a sewer myself. But a very cool plushie right here i think this is the same exact costume that he wears um in smash 64 it is from the original star fox games as well 3d and a very cool collection it's more like a chibi thing where like the head's bigger than the body and it's i just love how it has the tag on there it's very cool you guys saw this as well as rosalina in the update video i did so if you guys want to check that out go for it However, I am so happy to have him in here. This one was a little bit cheaper. I believe I got him for about $18 on Makari. Um, so cheaper for most Star Fox plushies. However, Fox, or not Fox, Falco. Falco, oh my God. Falco was like $70 to get. And I, I could not bring myself to get a Falco plush like that expensive. So for now on, 
Falco will have to wait to be added to the collection until I have some more funds where I can start doing that on here. Which hopefully in the relative future I'll be able to actually put uh, funds from making videos like these into getting plushies which would be so cool. Almost there. I think we're halfway there to the thousand subscriber mark or almost at least. Um, but yeah, a very cool group of plushies uh, that I already showed you before. However, one you guys have not seen yet. Um, I was actually hanging out with my friend Nick. I believe you might have seen him a little bit in my fan expo video I did recently. Um, he was the Mr. Miracle in the Hayden photos. And while we were there, uh, or hanging out, we went to Target. And in Target, they had the mother load. I did not have much money at the time. I just, I just had like spent, I think my check like finished up basically. I was getting paid the next day, but I just didn't have enough money to really spend or go crazy. However, there was one character I had to pick up and I just, literally, it's a part of my favorite franchise in Nintendo. One of my favorites at least, uh, definitely number two. And that is Meta Knight. Now Meta Knight, he started in Smash Melee. Or no, Brawl, Brawl, oh my god, I can't believe I just said Melee. Brawl, and he was overpowered. But a very cool character. He's one of the anti-heroes slash villains of the Kirby channel. And let's see, Meta Knight S. All-Star Collection as well. So, that Hydreigon is an All-Star Collection as well. Um, but those are Pokemon All-Stars. These are Kirby All-Stars. I might need to take this. Honestly, this might be cool to put up though to where he hangs off. I might have to see about doing that because that'd be cool. He flies. He does fly. You can see his little sword right here. And he's not too different from other Kirby plushies. I have Kirby over there somewhere that I could maybe pull out. But honestly, I think it'd be too much of a hassle to put all of them back in there. Um, it's more of a still plush. So you're not going to get too crazy whenever you're using it. It has some amazing felt right here. I love feeling felt. <laughs> I want to be honest. However, is it sharp? Nope, it's not sharp. Let's see, if that felt is sharp, that would be crazy. The cape feels pretty nice. He has these little shoulder pads, which are actually really hard. That was not, because I haven't really felt this plush, guys. I'll be honest. I bought it a few weeks ago, and I just put over here by Incineroar in the collection. But it's still an amazing plush. This might be one of my favorites that I actually have in the Smash Bros. collection. Uh, definitely one of the top five for sure. Um, because some of the other ones are kind of harder to get a look into. I do think Meta Knight makes a perfect plushie. He's just so round and you could say cuddly, but he'll probably cut you for that. Um, and I believe after that, that's the, I have one more plushie in the Kirby franchise and that is King Diddy, which I will have to probably find. I'm trying to like figure out where I would put him just by looking over there. Um, but I do think that would be a pretty cool plushie in the future. But yeah, so I have Meta Knight, I have Star Fox, and I have Rosalina, and these are the three newest additions to the Smash Collection. Um, like I've said, and some of the updates, I just haven't had the money or the time to really put much into the Smash or the Pokemon Collection as a whole. So I appreciate you guys being uh, being there for me, watching the videos whenever you see them coming out. I know my viewership has kind of declined a little bit, which obviously it's going to happen, but I know we can get it back up. Um, I have a lot of plans to show off. Starting with like my Marvel collection, my Toy Story collection, I have a few things I need to show off to you guys. But for now on, I have this today's upload with these three guys. We're gonna put them back over there and show you the collection updated. All right, and then we have Star Fox back over there next to Mewtwo, Lucario, and Detective Pikachu. I had to replace him for a little bit, although we do have regular Pikachu. You count that as Smash Bros. collection. We have Rosalina over here next to the Lamp and Yoshi. I'm um, kind of keeping the Mario characters together. I've kind of noticed that recently. Um, not all of them. We got Dr. Mario over there. And some of the Pokemon are together. And then we have a Meta Knight at the tip top. And like I said, I might have to put that up here and just hang it off. Um, I got some of these guys showing off right now. So I don't know about that for sure. But once I figure that out, you will definitely see it in a future video. But I think that's going to be it for you guys. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, hitting the like button and subscribe would be greatly appreciated. And comment which one of the three you prefer the most. That'll be the question of the day. Why not? But much love and care. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.